person. Hello. And uh, we are here for the pre-screening of Act of Valor. Uh, the awesome contest we had. A lot of the guys are showing up. Very cool. They're digging the swag. We got very cool stuff here. We can't even show yet, but uh, some very, very cool people gave some very, very cool things that we're going to be giving them away today. It's going to be fun. Are we having fun? Awesome. Yeah. Really good. I'm excited. All right. The movie's going to be insane. And uh, I can't show you the movie obviously here, but we'll see you after. Oh, yeah. He won a paintball pistol that's very cool, also engraved with the logo of the movie. And his dad is here with him. Excellent. So, a little bit further apart. So, good action in there. Get you both just on one side. That way you can. Wolf here with one of our grand prize winners of the Tim and TIPX, I believe. Tell me your name, sir. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, um, yeah, go in, get a good seat. Congratulations. And uh, I'll see you when you come out. Alrighty. And, uh, my friend Kaz from uh, Visual Reviews came by. What's going on? You ready? I'm ready. You ready? Ready. Yeah. Sure. I'm not an active zero member, but you know, <laughs> I'm probably one of the guys that they be shooting at. Nice. Round racist show. Oh, I like that. Yeah. yeah. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you for inviting me. The diva had to come late. You're always late, so I gotta show up. Late. It's my time to show up. All right. Next video review shows coming when? Uh, I'm gonna be doing a video tomorrow. Uh, some of the old paintball gear that I got, and like some of the gear that I run with. People have been asking me what I what I shoot and stuff. So recording that tomorrow when the girlfriend's at work, so she doesn't bitch when I'm videotaping. I don't know what he's talking about. Women never bitch. <laughs> Well, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, see you in there. Thank you, gentlemen. Welcome to this edition of the Wolf Den. Today, I'm going over a very, very cool product: uh, sport smoke smoke grenades. Smoke grenades are awesome when you're playing in a, a tactical game. You can use it for cover. You can use it for defense, offense. It's a great if you want to attack position or if you need to retreat, put some smoke up, and it's amazing, amazing, amazing when you need it. Um, this is the new company. They've been out for a few years and uh, they were very cool enough to send me some of their products. Sport Smoke really knows what they're doing and I'll tell you why. Hold on. They got two sizes. This is the Tactical Smoke Grenade and this is the, the, the very sexy Battlefield Smoke Grenade. Uh, these blow gray white smoke which is fine. They also sell very numerous different colors which is very cool for different scenario setups. And uh, I've used these in many games and they are awesome. The very good thing about them is that they are cold burning, which means they do not get hot when you hold them. All right, and that's very good because it's not necessarily when you hold them, but when you're in the field and you throw them, you do not want your smoke grenades to get hot because they will light stuff on fire. And Smokey the Bear don't like that, ladies and gentlemen. Um, yeah, cold burning is very important, especially for your local paintball fields. But you got dry season and you got dry beds around and uh, grass and leaves and stuff and it will catch fire very easily. These will not do it. Um, they're very good, all right? Some quick things, some quick things about them. They are pull ring, which is awesome. I hate the other smoke grenades where you have to tear it apart and knock it like a flare. These are very easy. Pull and go. Um, very field safe, as I said. Biodegradable shells, they break down and do not pollute our environment, which is very important in the sport that we play. Uh, today, I'll, I'll set off one of these. This is a tactical one. This is for the individual player to carry on him in his pack when you're in a clinch and you need some uh, cover. Pull this bad boy out. Now, theoretically, this sucker goes for, burns for about uh, 75 seconds. Get my timer here. Take that, boom. Now as my assistant ducks down in the background, uh, woo! now this might be hard to see me, but uh, it's blowing very good. Did you get that? Okay. 
flowing very good. Started my timer a little late. Well, I had on a few seconds because of that. Um, it's a uh, yeah, it is cold burning. I don't really feel much with a little bit. Made in the USA. Very important, ladies and gentlemen. I love to hear that. Made in the USA uh, is perfect for paintball and airsoft. Um, even perfect for like if you're having a rock concert or something. As long as you have the right license, it's awesome to set off. Um, it's superior coverage. Sports folk knows what they're doing. It's a very good product. And, uh, Running very good. Oh, sorry. Um, available in North America. If you want to get it in Canada, go to the place called Rocket Fireworks. Okay. Very. They're the sole distributors of this product. They know what they're doing. They're in Toronto, Ontario. I'll put the information down below. Um, yeah, that's going pretty good. So far, it's about 58 seconds plus 10 seconds, and it's still going. Um, these are. This is a tactical tactical grenade, the smaller of the two. The battlefield one, I don't know if I should do it here because that's like a three minute burner and it's huge and it's very cool. Oh, I love it. Um, now even though I've got my Kevlar gloves on, it's it's warm but it's not hot, which is which is essentially a cold burn. Um, I can put it in the snow. It'll barely melt it, it'll take a while. Very cool stuff. Uh, Sports Smoke knows what they're doing. These guys, have, I've written about them in Action Pursuit Games, and uh, they make a very, very good product. You were saying if I'm setting fire. That's cool. And <laughs> anything, um, yeah, get your local fields to invest in this stuff. It's feeling, feeling a little warmer now, but it's not hot, hot. Feeling a little warmer now, and uh, yeah, it's a great product. My goodness. Check them out. Um, do not try to make smoke grenades at home. It's stupid, it's not safe, it's probably illegal, and you do not want setting these off starting a major fire somewhere, especially on the point of paintball field that we love so much. All right, safety first, and we always want to play nice and have fun. Wolf Den, um, awesome, awesome product made in the USA. Um, it's not completely cold, it does get a little warm after it's done because it's still uh, got a bit of a reaction going on there, but it's awesome. And uh, I think that's about it for now. So I'm just going to take the snow, pack it in here. I always, whenever I use any kind of fireworks, I always put them in a bucket of water for safety-wise. Don't want her setting off for no reason. And yeah, that's about it. See you in a bit. Oh yeah, baby. Oh, Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Wolf's Den. My name is Wolf, your host of all things great and powerful in the paintball world. Today I am at Sergeant Splatter's uh, field in Toronto. We are talking about the brand new Tipman Multi-Tool. All right, this thing is badass. You need to check this out. Break it down for you, let you know if it's worth buying or not. Tipman has come out with the brand new Multi-Tool. It is crazy, it's got everything. If you own a Tipman marker, this has everything you need to make your gun work if you're out in the field, out in the bush, you need to tear it down, break it back up, go again. Let's try to fix it. Five, five Allen keys on this thing. Any part you could need for your Tibbon marker, right there, all right? That's amazing. You've got this little dental device to remove O-rings internally and externally. You've got your Phillips head screwdriver right there. Sexiness right there. You've got a knife. How you doing? <laughs> You've got a bottle opener with a nail file, well not just a file, I, I use it for my nails, you know, just to say, special days and whatnot. Uh, bottle opener and your flathead screwdriver, and you've got your knife for your basic uh, take apart breakdown needs. All right, and very cool within itself, adjustable wrench. There's been many, many times when I've been in the field, I need to take off a bottle. You can't do it if you're mailing the bush. You can't do it if your shop does not have the right equipment. You don't want to have to be walking around asking everybody for their stuff. Tipman has brought this out. It's crazy. I check it out. Sexiness, all right? Tell them Wolf sent you. Look down below in the description for Tipman's Facebook page. Ask him any question you want. Okay, brand, brand, brand new. You need to check this out. You've Many of you asked for it. This is the brand new... 3D patch. Damn! It's uh, made of rubber. It also comes in PVC. Can you see that? That is amazing. Uh, a young gentleman in Germany 
made this for me. He sent it to me in a courier and uh, this you cannot buy from the Wolf's Den. I will be coming out with other patches you can buy. I will be giving out one of these to one player at each big game that I host this year. To the most phenomenal player I see on the field, they'll be getting one of these Wolfden patches. Um, and it's just a sign of how awesome you are. <coughs> Plain and simple. Um, quick information on this. This is from a company called Patchwork. Patch W R E K. It's a German company, uh, as I said, based in Europe. You can get them in this rubber or PVC three dimensional patches. They're crazy. The owner uh, runs a paintball team over in Germany called the Silverbacks and he said he wanted to do something different for the whole industry and these things are awesome. They are very effective, they are very durable and they look outstanding. Okay, I will have their information below. They make patches, they make starter kits, they make everything for this. You need to check this out. It's for clubs, it's for teams, it's for corporations, it's for companies, it's for special events. Paintball or Airsoft. Yes, I said Airsoft. I know that's like the Antichrist to some of you guys, but it is what it is. And they're strong. These are the Velcro Wolf ones. I'll be coming out with these very, very, very soon. Some for sale. And like I said, these special red ones will be given to uh, MVPs of certain paintball games that I'll be attending. Watch out for me coming to Germany, Sweden, uh, Ecuador, Switzerland, and a few other paintball games. And uh, Greg Hastings, I'm coming for you. Hell yeah, baby. Uh, April 13th, I will be flying down to Texas to host a Holy Grail game. June 23rd is the biggest Canadian paintball game that might be happening. It's going to be me, Wolf versus Mike from Tech PB on Canadian soil. He's flying up from F Florida to challenge us paintballers. I need you there full force. The website is CanadianCarnage.ca. You need to be at this game. It's going to be insane. We will have everyone there. There's already 35 paintball teams listed to show up there. And there will be mass confusion, especially by my opponents, all right? Uh, remember to, hey, subscribe. Press that subscribe button. It may be here or there. B, uh, share this on your Facebook page. Share it with your friends and give it a thumbs up. Let's spread the word, the gospel of paintball all around the world. And follow me on Twitter at, at @wolfpaintball. I can't think of anything else right now because it's Sunday and I'm tired and I'm supposed to be sleeping right now. And uh, if you've noticed something here, <laughs> keep an eye out. Keep an eye out. You've all requested it, so it's coming. Wolf t-shirts are coming very soon. It's uh, still into the works. It's still working on some ideas and concepts, but keep an eye out. I know you want the posters and the t-shirts and I'm working on it for you. 2012 is not the year of the dragon, it's the year of the wolf, baby. We're going to make it happen. Paintball is going to be huge. Bigger than this. Is that possible? Is that possible? Oh, yeah, son, I'm out. What do you awesome. think of it? Just amazing. Yeah. Yeah, I just finished posting on Facebook. Awesome. <laughs> what do you think of it? Yeah, it was it was pretty good. Definitely. Pretty good, nice. Yeah. Okay. What do you amazing. Think? Yeah. Everything you wanted. Best movie I've ever seen. <laughs> really? Yeah. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What do you think of the movie? I thought it was excellent. Yeah. Very, very, very lifelike in a way. Yeah. And you're from Ireland. Yeah. That's awesome. How do you like it in Toronto? Love it. Okay, I'm glad you caught the movie, my friend. Yeah, thank you. You know what I'm going to say, Wolf? Amazing. Yeah, crazy. You know it. It was really good, yeah. Awesome. Brought a tear to my eye, too. Yeah, it's crazy. Tear Nice. For sure. Man, that was an amazing movie. Nice. Realistic. Yeah. Off my seat the whole time. Would you recommend it to others? Hell yeah, definitely, yeah. definitely, definitely. Go watch it tomorrow, watch it the day after. I mean, it's. Go watch it over and over yeah, again. Over and over again. Yeah, I'm yeah. definitely buying that DVD when it goes Hell yeah. I mean, it was fantastic. Yeah. I've been waiting to see it for a long time. It was absolutely awesome. Everything you expected? <laughs> and more. And you recommend more. it for others? I recommend everyone to go see it. If you like anything about guns or army or military or anything, gotta go see it. Beautiful. Best movie.